Hey, what's up everyone, Carlos here, and today we are talking about a Clash Quest Island update video, which just got released, and I would say we go directly into the reaction. Let's go. All right, let's go. Clans, clan weeks, classified, what? Munition mod, minus, oh wow, and a lot of items. Pineapple pizza, he did it, let's go, Darian, let's go, all right. I did not expect that. Okay, so. We've got a bit of content to cover today, so let's get started with the biggest feature going into this update. That's right, it's time to gather up 19 of your clans. Clans, please, clans, clans, clans. Clans are here. Let's go. Clans we are ready. Oh, that looks awesome. Was that a clan leak? To Clash Quest. Clans consist of 20 players in total. There are some social elements that will look familiar, like. Oh, that roles, looks good. Such as leader, etc as well as the familiar clan chat. So, what's there to do in a clan? Well, creating or joining a clan will allow you to take part in the clan league. Ooh, clan, clan leagues, league okay, that's cool. So we can compete against each other. Where you and your clan mates that's legendary league. Wait, 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 that means top members? Okay. To the so we have also competition in between clan a clan, that's nice. Lasts seven days and each clan member is allotted a single attack per league day. During the league season... Okay, one one attack per day? Okay, that sounds a little bit less, but the maybe they will increase map. that. The map has several stages you can decide to attack, and there are three different kinds of stages. Single stage, dungeon, and boss challenges. Ooh, each challenge nice. can be attempted only by a single person at a time. So, if you want to attempt a specific challenge, you'll need to wait until the previous player has completed their attempt first. The single stage challenge is simply just that. It's a single stage you'll earn a win for if you defeat just that one stage. And what's dungeon the reward? challenges are similar to the dungeons you can explore when you find a compass. However, instead of 20 stages, there are just 10, and your goal is to progress as far as possible until you run out of troops in your crew. Completing okay. each stage is worth one clan point, and your clan will earn extra points if all ten stages are defeated. Boss challenges okay. can feature different bosses. Are there new bosses? Quests, like Lava Hound and Papa Dragon. Clan points are awarded once the boss is defeated. One of the cool things about okay, the clan that's the new bomb bros. Is that damage is persistent. Oh, with Pekas. Oh, that's nice. Boss challenges, meaning if you only manage to complete. 50% of it on your Whoa, attack. wait, that was a new animation when you defeat the boss. That looks amazing. Damage is not persistent in the single stage challenges. The harder the level is, the more points each challenge. Okay, so single stage you need to solve, and then dungeon earns, and bosses you can solve together with the clan mates. However, that's cool, that's great. As I said earlier, each player gets one attack per league day. So it's important for your clan to strategically one attack decide per day. Okay. Attack, which stages and where to concentrate your efforts. Tactically choosing your challenges can be of great value. Also, if you fail an attack on a single stage challenge, your clan receives zero points and that stage is reset. If you check out the upper right hand corner, you will find the clan leaderboard. This is where you can check right, that's clan's cool. ranking. That's not a competition. And yes, I hope that every clan has the same setup well of uh, league day. League. So that is also fair and not random. You'll see the rewards you've gathered so far. Rewards are given to clanmates each day, also at the end of the league season. So that's, that's a, a lot of coins. Of how clans will function okay. In the hey, that, that's cool. Let me know in the comments what you think about it. So keep an eye out I'm very excited for and Wizard Lost already. Updates. In this update, we're also introducing a brand new zone for you to defeat. Boneyard. Yeah, let's go. Okay, no desert islands or so. Boneyard Beach. Hey, that looks awesome. With the new bomb miner, we see it here already. Would Darren say anything about it? Technically bosses. But wait, did I just say a new troop? Yeah, of course. That's right. We're bringing an all new, all original troop to Clash Quest. Meet. 
Bomb miner. Bomb miner. Let's go. Miner we saw it already on my channel. Weapon. If you haven't seen it, then check out the video. Armed with a mighty explosive. This would be a really Bomb cool miner. unit. Underground. And you definitely need to play different. Kind of like a reverse version of Prince. Oh, that's cool. Course, that's cool. Bomb miner can level up my favorite will be the middle, the second item, the charging bomb. But also the other bows might be helpful for some stages. You'll encounter our brand new boss says Bone Brothers. Yeah, they they are good. They are good. I've done a fight now a couple of times. They're really tough. Like two reckless puppies. Our princes are completely misplaced here in that stage, Connor, so it makes it really hard. That is actually cool now with the stun. Something new in the game. Would be interesting if that also happens in the league then. I don't know. We've got two all new enemy characters who scurry about on the board. Oh, new enemies. Let's go. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, my God. I want a blushy from him. <laughs> okay. He's stunning. Okay. I see. Oh, my. Yeah, Darian. Blushy. Do it. Do it. Oh, my God. I want this blushy. Scared Skelly carries a heavy metal helmet that he can hide behind when taking shelter that's not a metal helmet there your attacks do reduced damage against him when he can muster up enough courage he'll toss you a bone as his attack now you didn't think those were the only new characters did you did you one of the most did we questions we've received is why isn't there a boss for shock shores i guess our only oh world wiper to slither his way there. let's so go the new boss world wiper that looks awesome oh that looks like snake Tesla's released their deadly arcs of electricity the only way to defeat volt wiper is to destroy the teslas his head is invulnerable ah those are teslas okay has zero effect Ooh, you okay without some much needed assistance that's cool magic yo so we got spotted on discord already with the stickers the clash universe and what are those doing is no exception each of these different magic ah they're on the back okay different effect undo clock this allows undo. you to can you undo a, a spell or attack oh you can undo your attack okay did that troop combo not have the how can you get them is that a pay to win feature yeah, that's cool. To try else. It's helpful. Magic wand. I guess that will not be a well when leaks. I amount to damage to three random targets. It's great for clearing out those extra defenses on the board. Summon bell. This allows you to summon reinforcements to aid you. Just like the dragon. No, wait, what? You can't just get extra troops? Summon bell, you'll be presented with options to join your Do, Wait, wait, what? You can use them unlimited? Uh, unless you have them? Okay, shuffle dice. Uh, shuffle dice is like a reroll, but during the stage or what? Token? Okay. This is a magic item version of the reroll feature already in game. Can only be used. Wait, reroll is already in game, this and now it's a reset token. Your starting lineup and can possibly even pull Does it replace the reroll or is it on now, top? You should note that hey, magic that's cool. items cannot be used in the clan leagues. Okay, and I guess not in a regular one. Earthquake and switch. All right, what are they doing? I mean, earthquake is sure. Okay, that that was a cross. Did you see that? That's a cross damage. Earthquake will deal damage directly to its target. Ooh, nice. Wait, three hundred fifty-two. That's more than a fireball. That's more damage. Oh, that's cool. Regardless of where they are on the you can just switch any positions. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that would be funny in League. Nice. Those are nice additions. Include a level recommendation system. Now, this machine learning powered system will recommend where you're most likely to gain more stars. And this system takes the shape of an adorable parrot named after everyone's favorite weekday meme. Wednesday, my dudes. Going into this, what was that? Are some what? 
to leagues. What was the parrot? Dungeons. So, for the full patch notes, check the links in the description below. What was the parrot? Please don't forget to tap what? the like and subscribe button and make sure you leave a comment. Also, absolutely, I do. Register at clash.com to find out when Clash Quest will soft launch in your region and to stay on top of all the latest Clash Quest news. This is your captain signing off. Oh, wow. The clan link oh. tab and you'll present that. He defeated the entire. It's hard to moonwalk in socks. Here's a quick impression of the Tesla Viper. I want to check once again what that parrot was because I did not understand that correct. So let's tune back into the Wii U quickly. Some of the quality of life improvements include a level recommendation system. A level a recommendation system. Powered system will recommend where you're most likely to gain more stars. And uh, ah, this okay. system takes the shape of an adorable parrot named ah, okay. everyone. So he will favorite. All right, I see. All right. So that just means that this parrot tells you where you might get more stars if you're figure if you need more stars and if you don't know which island should you go for that would be very interesting if that one will work on my uh level one account uh so yeah cool nice addition uh, i'm very excited for it all right that was the island update oh my god so much new stuff um i won't go into details now because there might be some videos coming up because yeah uh i'm lucky that i could I uh, take already my hands on the game and today actually on my main account there will be two more videos uh, in the next two three hours. There will be a specifically video about clans, there will be a specifically video also like here about all the new features etc also with gameplay. So <clears throat> don't forget to head on into my main channel, uh, don't forget to subscribe here let me know in the comments what you think about the upgrade i think it's really cool i'm very excited for it especially the clans wizard lost clans are so ready uh but actually i was very surprised about that parrot at the end i have no idea what that means and yeah uh i'm very excited i hope the update drops very soon stay tuned i'm out and we see us in the next video cut us off bye bye